Okay, so we're four days away from 2020, so today it's finally the time that I do the challenge I've been waiting for the whole year. And that means the color of the year challenge. Each year a company called Pantone is announcing the leading color for the upcoming year, which is probably the most anticipated news for graphic designers, fashion industry and basically everyone that is somehow concerned or interested in visual culture. And this year's color of the year, I mean 2020 color of the year, is announced to be classic blue. So today's challenge will be to create a character inspired by this color. So let me just grab my sketchbook and some of my favorite blue markers and let's see what happens. So I'm starting off with swatching all of those shades that I picked and well, I forgot to press the record button so you can see just the end of the swatching process, but well, I hope you're gonna forgive me for that. From all those colors, I think that the best ones are B106 and 70, and also another 70 in the lower row, which is an Ohuhu marker. They look brighter on the camera, but they look very accurate to the classic blue in reality. So I think I'm gonna use these three shades the most. Alright, so today I'm totally skipping the sketching part because I already have a very exciting idea for today's drawing. So recently I saw this picture of Asa Brocky on Pinterest and I really liked his pose on that picture, so I thought that today I'm gonna use it as my reference. And my idea is to keep the pose pretty much the same as on the picture, but switch the outfit to something that will be just a combination of textures, layers and different shades of blue, because that's my main goal for today. So like you can already guess, I'm gonna be drawing a guy today. And well, honestly, sketching this pose is quite tricky, even with the reference picture, because there's just a lot of foreshortening and a lot of different angles and perspectives, so there is really a lot to think about. And being so used to drawing girls as I am, I need to take some time to perfect this pose and make sure that everything I drew is quite well done. And that's why, like always, I'm using my trusty Cole Erase Pencil and this time I picked a blue shade to fit our today's color scheme. And I'm using this pencil for sketching because it's very soft and easy to erase, so it gives me almost an endless possibility to go over some lines again and again and erase them multiple times. And that gives me this comfort of working and peace of mind because I don't need to stress out about my graphite pencil smearing around and just digging holes into my paper because with Call Erase everything is just way more simple and enjoyable. So now that I think my sketch is looking pretty cool, I'm moving on to outlining it first with my mechanical pencil to get a good grasp of all the proportions and everything all together as a whole. And at this point I'm really liking how this drawing is turning out and I'm just so impatiently waiting to color it. But before that, once I'm done with my graphite outline and once I'm pretty sure that I won't be changing or fixing anything in this drawing, I'm just taking my fine liner and I'm going over the whole drawing again and just doing those last touch-ups with my black fine liner. And now we're finally approaching my favorite part, which is coloring. And for his skin tone, I'm thinking that something like a medium caramel complexion will be a perfect fit for our today's color scheme because I'm thinking that a medium brown shade will contrast really good with a darker denim-like blue and I think it will make for a perfect combination. But in general, I think that this year's color of the year, meaning classic blue, is such a universal and such a beautiful color in fact. And looking back at the 2019 and 2018 colors of the year, they were a little bit more extraordinary and out there, I would say, which wasn't anything bad. 
And compared to this year's color of the year, it's quite surprising that they picked something that is a little bit more toned down and something that is a little bit more, again, universal. And well, I'm really happy to see that, and even though I'm not a person that is wearing colors on a daily basis, I'm literally walking around wearing white and black, so for me colors are pretty much only existing in my drawings. And then I'm also having my favorite color schemes, favorite shades, and blue is actually one of them. I remember that some time ago someone in the comment section noticed that that most of the times I pick blue as the shade of the pants or jeans for my characters. And then I realized that this is actually true. I rarely draw black jeans or white or any other color. And that's because I've always considered blue jeans as such a staple and an element of clothing that goes with pretty much any other color. And with that being said, I just got so used to drawing blue jeans on my characters that it was just like my drawing go-to. So well, with all that being said, I'm super excited for this year's color of the year and I'm just curious to see if it's gonna appear in, for example, clothing stores, in the makeup industry, in the graphic design industry. I'm excited to see what people are gonna come up with using this color. And what is your guys' opinion? Do you like this color? Were you expecting something else? Please let me know in the comments. Ooh, baby on the track, I'm going room, room. Try and catch me when I pull up in a zoom, zoom. Oh, no. Please don't make that call. We don't want no call. Stay ready for the cause. Ooh, baby on the track, I'm going room, room. Try to catch me when I pull up in a zoom, zoom. Sure. Looking for some more and Ferrari going raw. Want you to work? I heard about your resume. Skirt, open up the sesame. Work, yeah. Oh no, no, don't pressure me. Yeah, ooh, yeah. Roll out with the referee. Curb, yeah, yeah. I'm turning left now. Burn, yeah. The rubber's on my chest now. First, no, you're not the first one. They done told me I'm the worst one. Always the pedal to the floor, yeah, I'm more in center And I don't know what's in my trunk, I'm always front and center Try to Rory down the coast, yeah, rockin' my new road, yeah Always on the road and I don't need no sweater Ooh, baby, on the track, I'm going room, room Try and catch me when I pull up in that zoom, zoom Ooh, nah, please don't make that call Me don't want no cars, they ain't ready for the cause Ooh, baby, on the track, I'm going room Solo, pace, yeah, I'm speeding in my polo. Wait, no, I don't have time for slow mo. I've been doing this all my life just for the lolo. I'm in the shower, I've been sober for an hour. When you see me pour up, I need something to devour. Yeah, I'll play it louder. Yeah, I do a crosser. Yeah, I'm doing better. All my haters give me power. Ooh, baby, on the track, I'm going room, room. Try and catch me when I pull up in that zoom. Alright, and that is pretty much what my today's drawing looks created using the color of the year 2020. And please let me know what do you guys think. Personally, I'm super happy that I've decided to draw a guy and I think that with all the layers and all the textures, different materials, different shades on his outfit, it made this color of the year pop even more and different shades and textures tied everything together even better. So well, I'll be wrapping up for today. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really hope that you enjoyed it. And if you did, please don't forget to leave thumbs up after my video and subscribe to my channel to be up to date with my upcoming videos. And well, I love you all and I can't wait to see you in my next videos. Take care. Bye. I'm just going with the gut. Never had a doubt. Felt like this is just
just a must Put me in perspective, I'm the deepest in the cut Everybody tuning in, but this is just for us now